What's going on guys? Back at it again with another Fallout New Vegas video. This one in particular, we're going to be going back to the strip. Because we're going to be doing some sneaky infiltration type stuff with uh, the Omeritas over on, again, at the strip. They are one of the families that are on the strip, so that's actually really cool that we're going to be seeing what's up with them specifically. So, if you're excited for this video, do me a huge favor, drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed. Because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get going. Alright, so first things first, Boone and Rex, they're right there just chilling, of course. Let's go ahead and, uh, hold on. Uh, fast travel to the strip. Um, I always get confused which one's which, to be honest. Is it here? I don't know, let's just, let's just pick one, we'll figure it out. And we're definitely in the wrong one. It's okay though. We got a long way to run, though. But we'll make it there eventually. Um, we're on like the side of the damn strip. All right, it's all good though. Did someone just shoot at me? Oh, dude, the king laid him out. Freeside thug. He was trying to go against a king with nothing more than a lead pipe. Yeah, bruh. You're going to need a little bit more than that, won't, uh, don't you? All right. All your shopping needs. Um, Hello. maybe later. All right. Now we got to go all the way to the other side of the strip, of course. Excuse me, sir. Lovely old king man dude. Look at Rexy boy. Mr. Cybernetic Dog. I wish Dog Beat was in this game. Oh, I know you don't want some of this. <laughs> How do you like them apples, buddy? Sheriff's hat. Don't mind if I do. Dude, there's so many dead people here. It's not even funny. Alright, luckily we're here. So let's go ahead and put this away before the robots end up killing us. Yeah, is this seriously another one? Can't run from me. Alright, let's watch this go down. Rex took out two of them and Boone took out one of them. Rex is really proving to be a good dog. Thank you for visiting new things. Um, thank you? I guess? Alright, are we here yet? Um, Omerita's. I believe that's that hotel right there? No, wait. I think it's... I think it's the Gamora, but I think we have to go to the NCR Embassy first and find out some information about it. If I remember correctly. I mean, I guess I could always just look at the quest, huh? Uh, speak to Lisa O'Malley at the NCR Embassy on the strip for a lead on the Omeritas. See? I know what I'm doing. I've played this game once or twice before. Well, we should probably rest till the morning. Uh, that would be fine right there. By the time we get there, it'll be time for them to be... At work, pretty much. I've literally, at least not that I can remember, I don't think I've ever been in that building. Hello. Hi. Sure, wasted ass freaking troops over here. Hello. You're Lisa? Welcome back. What can I do for you this time? Um, actually, I wanted to talk to you about something specifically. Uh, you know, more over at the, uh, at the Hoover Dam? She actually sent me over here to talk to you about the Omeritas. Ah, excellent. I received word you may be coming. We helped the receptionist over at Gamora with some thugs that were taking advantage of her. She owes us a favor. Go talk to her. She'll be able to point you in the right direction. That's it? That's all you got for me? Oh. What a waste. 
I could have just went straight there. Oh, but wait a minute. We have a problem, don't we? Where's my guns level? Stats, skills, guns. 60, I guess it's not too bad. But we do have a problem. Because in order to go inside the, uh... Inside the, uh, what are they called? The casinos. We need holdout weapons. I don't think I have any holdout weapons. So I'm gonna have to speak to that one dude that sells holdout weapons. Uh, I believe it's this dude right here. Um. You're gonna need a little bit more than just tape, lady. Some crazy days on the strip. Still, it's good for business. Um. Uh. Let's see what you have. Take a look at these beauties. I mean, we could do a silence 22. I mean, really, that's the only thing I have. Let's see what ammo he has. Well, let's buy all of his ammo. Fuck it. Let's go. What is it? Shut up. Maybe if we're lucky... Hey, no one but Omeritas are allowed to carry guns into Gamora. Check your weapons with me. Um, okay. You'll get these back on your way out. All right, let's see um what weapons we have. Yeah, it's just the 22. So let's go ahead and put this on our hip. Hello. Hello and welcome to Gamora. What can I help you with today? Um, I'm calling in for an outstanding balance for some information. Tell me what the Omeritas are up to. I knew someone would call in that mark soon. What do you want to know? Um Well, tell me what the family's up to. Sorry, they don't tell me their plans, and I don't want to know. I'm just happy they don't make me fuck anybody anymore. Any more? Holy shit. Okay. Um, well, I need to know uh, who to talk to about what's been going on in Gamora. All I can tell you is to find Kachino. He's the lowest level lieutenant you're going to be able to talk to. Some of the girls say he's been involved in some shady business the family wouldn't really like. Ask him about it. Okay. Cochino. Cochino in Spanish is something completely different. Gamora has the loosest slots on the strip. <laughs> yeah, Alright then. Not really information I needed to know, but thank you? I I guess. Oh look, it's Cochino. I hear you've been asking questions about me, dickweed. What the fuck do you want? You know what? You need to shut the hell up before I blast you right in your freaking face, guy. I hear you've been doing some business on the side, by the way. Business? What the fuck do you mean, business? You looking to get yourself burned? Now you start talking real clear, and I mean fucking crystal clear, because I'm about to lose my patience. Um... Um... Let's see... Hold on. Let's, uh, save it. And... Hold on. No, how do... There we go. And then we'll try to pickpocket him. The tops is a... Hey, look. You again. What the fuck do you want? Check it out what I found. Uh, I hear you've been dealing with some business that's off limits for the family. I don't give half a dick what you heard. Now get the fuck out of my face before I burn your sorry ass. Real snooze. Am I supposed to read it first? Is that is that what's what? I hope they get some new shop. Um, you again? I found this ledger that proves some uh of your side business. <laughs> oh shit! Excuse me, man. You know what? All right, hold on. Where the fuck did you get that? Okay, listen, buddy. Picked it out of your ass, some buddy. Dangerous shit you got there. That book can get me killed if the wrong people see it. Let's talk. What do you want? What can I do for you? Mm. <clears throat> mm. 
Let me see. Do you think the family would like to see this? I can't stop you, but that's gonna mean my death. I can make it worth your while to give it to me, though. Plus, if you go to the bosses, I can't help you stop what they've been doing. Um... Is it worth a hundred for you? I can pay you for it, of course. I also have some information about the family's business that you might find interesting. Between you and I, we can break up what they're planning, maybe save some lives. Mine included, of course. Yeah, okay. hundred caps and you'll break up whatever. Okay, got it. Oh, here's some caps. Now give me the journal. All right, there we go. So let me tell you what I know about the family's business. The bosses, Big Sal and Nero, have been working for a while on this. They're arming themselves like an army, using this new guy, Troik. They also brought in a specialist named Clandon. At least that's what they introduced him as. All right. So, what kind of specialist is this Clandon of yours? I got no fucking idea. They let him have the run of the place, though. He seems like a nice guy, but he makes me nervous. He's a little arrogant, but he's too nice. Too open. I've never seen him fucking a gambler. Everyone has a vice, but this guy seems like the Pope. That's interesting. Well, let's, uh... Okay, toss him at me. Tell me what's up with Mr. Troik. He's a skittish little fucker. Spends half the day pumping his body full of chems and the other half pumping hookers with his willy. He has some <laughs> kind of connections, so he's able to smuggle huge shipments of weapons into the strip. The bosses got him by the short hairs. We covered up a hooker he killed while flying on some psycho, so he gets his guns in exchange for not ratting. Um, okay. Okay, toss them at me. Do you know anything about what they're planning? No, just that it involves guns and muscle. Also that it's big. Very big. Only Nero and Big Saul know everything. And they ain't telling. Okay, Looks like we gotta get to me. the bottom of this. Um, alright, that's everything Let's for see. now. So, what's the, what's the update? We need to find, uh... Wait, how little we know? We need to this one so talk to Troy about the mysterious K and then find out what's going on with Camden and it's all right tracking so we got two hit points I just need to remember how to get there because I don't really remember how to get there uh, do we have to get on the hook? um all right well one way is here I guess we'll go to lower brimstone I don't really know which or where specifically we need to go but um, I guess we'll figure it out. Look at her. She's super skinless. <laughs> oh, God. You can hear it. It's very, uh, loud. Um, you're not going to kill me, are you? All right, good. Um, I think it's upstairs, maybe? I don't know where the hell I'm supposed to go, to be honest. Alright, I can't go through there. Oh, wait, I found one of them. Hello, hey, Trike. Who are you? I didn't do anything. Leave me alone. Um. Kachino sent me to talk to you about some guns. Kachino? Kachino what? Are you kidding me? He must be trying to get me killed. I'm looking to help Kachino break up whatever bosses are planning. Yeah? Well, fuck that. The bosses have my number, and I'm a company man while they got the goods on me. Oh, dude, I'm one lower. Okay, let's see if I have anything. Wait, was that speech? Um. Yeah, it was speech. So let's see if I have anything that'll increase my speech at all. Please? Do I have anything? Well, charisma. Hello. You again. Make it quick. Um. There we go. If you don't help me, I'll report uh, your work to the NCR. Great. So I'm fucked either way. I guess I don't have any choice but to help you. Just try not to get me killed here. Oh, I lost karma for that? Oh, well. Uh, 
So what can you tell me about the guns on the Emeritus have? They're keeping them in a little utility section down off the basement. I don't know what they're arming themselves for, but I know it isn't for the good of mankind. So how do I how do you get the guns into the strip? I'm pretty proud of myself. It's a stroke of genius if I could be so modest. The whole arrangement starts with an old buddy of mine in the Republic. He's responsible for packing and shipping supplies to the NCR on the strip. He marks some containers as food and medical and packs them with guns and other shit. From there, it took just a couple of greased palms to get someone to let me cherry pick a container or two out of every shipment. Easy as pie. Oh, that's interesting. Um, what can we do to take care of, uh, of the guns? As a little pet project, I've been making some thermite. Thermite burns as hot as the devil's asshole and can melt through just about anything. I've been keeping it so if the family betrays me, I can hopefully do some damage before I end up dead or in jail. Yeah, that's good. So if you don't deploy the thermite yourself, I feel like this would get him killed. I'll destroy the weapons. Okay, here's the thermite and a key to the room where the guns are stored. Place the thermite on the crates in the room. I rigged the light switch outside the room to kick off a spark big enough to hold the thermite. That should turn that shit into molten slag. As soon as we're done talking, I'm gonna make myself like a ghost. I don't want to be anywhere near here when the bosses find out. All right, cool. Um, that's it, I okay, guess. Okay, cool. So where the hell is this utility room? Honestly, I'm kind of like winging it right now because I really don't know where the hell anything is. Main level. Um. Alright, what's in here? No. I gotta figure out where the hell all of this stuff is, to be honest. Because I don't know where anything is, realistically. So, I'm kind of just winging it, to be honest. Um. I gotta find the utility room. Hiya! Let's dance. Woo woo! Woo woo! I just got down and dirty with the with the prostitute. All right, where the hell are we going? It was upstairs, wasn't it? Damn it. Um, I'm kind of confused right now. All right, so this is the elevators. So I don't think we need the There's elevators. Some shit going on between NCR and the Legion. Better not fuck with our power. And then I think these are just rooms. Open door. Okay, we at least we could go downstairs this way. Alright, and now we just did a gigantic circle, didn't we? Alright, we gotta figure this out. Because I have no freaking idea. It's probably downstairs. Um, wait, is this? Ooh, I found it. We could have literally just walked right out the door. Um, it's literally all this stuff, isn't it? Open foot locker. This is a sniper rifle. I'll take that. And that. Sure. Why not? Look at all this stuff, dude. There's like all kinds of stuff like assault, car assault carbines and everything. All right, how do I... Oh, place thermite. Do I have to put it on every single one of them? There's that. Okay, there's one back here. Is that it? I think that's it. Um... Just double checking, make sure. I think we're good. Let's see if it updated at all. Um, uh, how do I destroy it though? Do I just walk away? I should have probably asked him how to destroy it. So, looks like we can go up here. I think this is how you get to the There's other dude. Serious shit going on between NCR and the Legion. 
If you say so, bro. Alright, so the other guy is right here, apparently. Oh, I remember this guy. This is the dude that has some shady shit. What's up, Clandon? Hey, nice to meet you. Do you need help with something? Mm. Hold on. Um, Where is it at? I think it's in his room. Get out of my way, guy. Someone's getting it really hard. Alright, we should save it right here just in case we get caught, though. No, not that. Safe. Oh, I don't have 75. You know how I could do this, though? Our hidden club key. I'm just going to guess it's this. Beep. Crap. All right. So I have to reload this because I got caught. Since I can't pick this, I'm going to have to pick it out of his freaking pocket. All right. Come on, baby. Let's try this again. Thief. Damn. We're going to get that damn key. We are. Quietly. And there we go. Now the question is, sheriff. is that the That's key that I need? Anymore. That's not even the damn key I need. Oh, God. Uh, maybe it's his, maybe it's the other key that he has. All right, let's save it one more time, just in case. Thief! Aw, oh, man. All right, come on, baby. Thief! <laughs> it's a lot of reloading, isn't it? Come on. Thief! All right, it, we have to make it work right here. And thief! Damn it! This is a pain in my ass right now. Thief! How unlucky are we? Whoops. Thief! What's the. Does it tell me the percentage that I have? Let me see. It doesn't tell me the percentage. Thief! Is that even the key that I need? Not sure. Thief! Shut the hell up. Stop calling me a thief. I'm not a thief if you don't find out that I'm stealing from you. Which is my goal. There we go. Oh my god, someone's getting it hardcore. There we go. I'll be taking that. Thank you very much. Now let's go talk to him again. Um. Um. Should we confront him? Or... Tell Kachino. Uh, let's confront him. Good to see you again. Hope you're winning some money in here. Um, I think the authorities would like to hear uh, these tapes I found in your safe. I think I should kill you before you have a chance to show those tapes to anyone. What do I have to lose? Um... Uh, you can't... You can't have these tapes, but I'll keep them to myself if you leave and never come back. Fuck, I was getting tired of this place anyways. I can find girls to play with somewhere else. Good, get the hell out of here. 
Uh, won't be able to help. Kachina should be informed. All right, let's go tell Kachina. Are bad for business. NCR should do the fucking job. My question is now: How the hell do I blow up the freaking guns? Let's go tell Kachina. Hold on, I gotta find out how to fucking blow this up. Clearly, it's here somewhere. Oh, activate detonator. Um. Holy fuck. That was loud. And explosive. But we took care of business. So let's go find Kachino and let him know that everything has been taken care of. Those two mob bosses are not going to be happy at all, are they? It's all good, though. I'm not worried about it. Who the hell is this guy? Oh, he's just a, an Omero the thug. Alright, ready? Let's go! Alright, let's dance again. Whoop, 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 whoop. Whoop, 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 whoop. Dance time, dance time. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Alright. What's up, Kachino? Hey, what can I do for you? Um... Well, the guns are destroyed. Whoa, you managed to pull that off? Solid work. That ought to gum up the boss's plans. Also, on top of that, Clandon is leaving Gamora and won't be coming back anytime soon. Oh, is that right? Well, I guess if he's gone, he's gone. I don't need to know anything more than that. Good, because you don't need to know anything else. What's next on breaking up the boss's plan? Now we cut off the head of the serpent. Big Saul and Nero have to die. Um, how do we take care of the bosses? Wait, what happens when they're done? When they're, when when they're, they're gone? gone? I'm gonna run this joint. Don't worry, I'll take care of this place. Yeah, I trust you. Um, how do we take care of them? They're a little bit upset about what's been done to muck up their plans. They tasked me to find out who's responsible. There isn't gonna be another chance <clears throat> to get both of them together in the same room. I'll slip you a gun and we can take them out. Alright, sounds good. Oh, speech. No, I'm not going to do that. Um, let's go take care of the bosses then. Hurry and get ready. I'll give you a gun when you get to the room. All right, cool. Um, I guess we got to follow Kachino. Can you be any more slower, bro? Hello. Hi. Here, let me open the door for you since you're super fucking slow. Any day now, Kachino. I already have a gun. Does this gun even do damage? Uh, let me see. How much does this do? Seven? It does seven? Fuck, I mean, I guess. I mean, we still have, uh, Rex and, uh... Wait, where the hell are they anyways? Oh, there he is. Rex and Boone. We're gonna be able to knock them out so quick, it's not even funny. It's gonna be what? One, two, three, four against two. Okay, I don't wanna get in trouble, so open the door for me, Kachino. Thank you. Oh, damn, they're. They're in big trouble. So, what now? Do I sit down? Let me switch camera views. Hello. Hey, you're the one everyone's talking about. What business you got with me? Um. Okay. Hey, here's that gun I promised you. I suggest using it while they are talking. Let's have I'm some sure they're gonna kill you after Take they a talk. seat on the couch so we can get to talk. Wait, really quick. This does a hell of a lot more damage. So I will be equipping that. I'm gonna turn them. Check this so out. So I assume you know why we called you here. Um, nope, not at all. Well, you've been a real thorn in our side. We've got business plans. You set us back a little bit, I'll admit that. However, we wanted you to know that nothing you did made a ship bit of difference, and you're going to die of failure. Um, um, 
All right. All right. Let's go. Uh, fuck it. Let's go. No, not Kachino. Big Sal. See you later, Sally Nander. Nice clip there. Too easy. Hey, thanks for all the hard work back there. I'm gonna run a tight ship here, don't you worry. Um, I'm planning on playing some games in the casino. Of course, after all you did for me, here are some chips for you. Play, have some fun. Thank you. Bye. This Can I... <laughs> Can I bring my guns whenever I want? Big Sal's password. Gamora office key. 12 gauge rounds. Sure, why not? What about you? What do you have? Um, sure. Is there a safe in here or anything that I can use? Open desk. Well, uh, let me take that ammo. Um, I don't see a safe. So I think we got screwed out of that one. Oh, well. Let's go ahead and get out of here, and then we'll put on our... Oh, dance time. Hey. I got them. I got the dance moves, man. All right, let's go ahead and get out of here and get our guns back. Oh, at least they they're they're having a good time with Kachino being the leader. All right, let's get our weapons back. Uh, first things first, I want my tri beam. There we go. And now we go where? Return to Colonel Moore. Uh, sounds like a plan. Hoover Dam. She is gonna be extremely happy with our progress. We completely took out the leaders and established our own. Patrolling the Mojave almost makes you wish. Alright, let's go down here. Where are we going? This place is pretty well fortified, man, all things considering. Alright, excuse me, sir. I gotta talk to uh, Colonel Moore. I, um... Maybe. Hey, where are you going? Come here. Have you discovered what the Omertas are up to? Yeah, actually I was. Uh, they were up to something pretty damn big, but you know what? I got it covered. Excellent. You'd think living in the lap of luxury and power would be enough for some people, but no. But we have other problems. While investigating the Amertas, what little I could on my end, I came across something much more sinister. Evidence suggests that Mr. House is planning to make some kind of move when the battle breaks out, and I'm guessing he won't be coming to our rescue. While we don't know what his exact plans are, my orders are to take no risks. I'm sending you to take Mr. House out of the equation. Any questions? Um... What evidence do you have that Mr. House will be making a move? We've had reported sightings of Mr. House's Securitron spying on both NCR and Legion forces. Also, given a recent analysis of the sightings, we now estimate that Mr. House has at least four times as many Securitrons as previously assumed. He wouldn't show his hand like that if he weren't prepared to move. And neither the NCR or Legion can spare the troops to investigate. Which is why I'm sending you. Any other questions? Oh, uh, what do you think he's up to, exactly? To name a few things off the top of my head, expand his borders, get the NCR and Legion to wipe each other out, and seize Hoover Dam. Any other questions? Yeah, I mean, that's pretty logical. Um, will getting rid of Mr. House have a hu have huge repercussions in New Vegas? Perhaps, but that's not my problem. Vegas is a nice place for the men to go on vacation, but it'd be an acceptable loss next to the dam. Uh, well, no, no more questions then. Good, then you have your orders. See that Mr. House does not present a problem. Dismissed. Deuces. I guess now we gotta take care of, uh, big boss man over there Didn't himself. Me. It's kinda sad because, uh, he gave us our house. Heh, <laughs> get it? He gave us our house and his name is House. <laughs> Anyways. Alright. Looks like we're taking a nice little trip all the way back to the Hoover Dam. 
But we're going to go ahead and leave it right here right now, guys. In the next video, we're definitely going to be going and figuring out what exactly we're going to be doing with Mr. House. Um, most likely, realistically, most likely, I'm just going to end up taking him out. But we'll cross that bridge once we get there. But if you enjoyed this video, do me a huge favor. Drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed. Because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, catch you guys in the next one. Deuces.